Welcome to the Monday Music Minute. I'm your host, Eric Gill, Communications Director for St. Lucie County. I'm Mark Freed with the St. Lucie County Library System. Welcome to a Monday Music Minute. Each week we come on the show and tell you our favorite musical finds on Freegal, which is a free service that allows you to stream and download music thanks to your St. Lucie County Library card. Now, the pandemic's triggered a lot of strange behaviors this past year, and one of those was the resurgence of sea shanties, which apparently was a thing on TikTok. And to celebrate the 100th anniversary of the Fort Pierce Inlet, my friends at Pierce Cider in downtown Fort Pierce are hosting a she, uh, see, I know I was going to mess this up, a sea shanty contest this Wednesday, May 26th. And if you need some inspiration, plug into Freegal and search she shanty, and you'll find a boatload of traditional call and response sailing songs on the 1960 release by Robert Shaw titled Sea Shanties. Or check out the 2015 album by Friends of the Shipyard and Fisherman's Fray, Sea Shanties, Songs of the Sea. I think this one's the best because it's got an excellent Beach Boys classic, Sloop John B. Mark? The only thing that should be listened to louder than metal guitars or screaming punk music is classical music. No other music has such dynamic highs and lows as classical. From the soft flute solo to strings weaving their magic, or brass being bombastic, classical music has it all, and you need to listen to it really loud to really appreciate and catch all the nuance. Lately, I've been in a Bach kind of mood. More specifically, I've been listening to Johann Sebastian Bach's Brandenburg Concerto No. 3, which was written between 17, 19, and 20. Uh, clocking in at around 12 and a half minutes, the faster tempo first and third movements bookend a shorter, slower middle movement. This work consists of three violins, three cellos, and three violas, and a harpsichord at times, weaving their magic. This is one of Bach's more popular concertos, if not one of the more popular classical concertos of all time. It's a great entry into classical music. Definitely check it out. That does it for this week's Monday Music Minute. Have a great Monday.